Or about the Miami police officer who was intentionally hit by a stolen car driven by a man who was desperate to get away. Local 10's Leah Morajon is live from JMH with an update on her condition and the man police now have in custody. Leanne. I just checked with Miami police. They say it's going to be a long road to recovery for this detective. Meanwhile, the suspect that is also here at the hospital and facing charges has been arrested several times before in other states, including Minnesota, Illinois, uh, Iowa and Wisconsin. Tonight we know he's facing multiple charges. Detective Marvelin Lee Chin, a former officer of the month and nearly 20 year veteran officer of Miami police, continues to recover from serious injuries to her limbs after police say a suspect ran her over in a stolen car. Completely rammed it in tour. Police say 49 year old Andrew in Wardell is also in the hospital under police custody. It happened in Overtown near Northwest 2nd Avenue and 12th Street. According to his arrest form, Wardell had just punched a man in the face and stolen his Nissan Murano. He then drove off and crashed it into a parked car. He took off with the car and finally officers tried to stop him. When Detective Chin arrived in her unmarked unit, police say she came out in uniform. That's when Wardell allegedly rammed the car right into her. Struck the officer up in there against the vehicle. The carjacking victim told police he saw the whole thing and also said he thought the officer was dead. A second officer was able to take Wardell into custody, but not before he allegedly tried to punch them. He tried to turn it around the corner. They chased him down to stop him. The units responding subsequently were able to take the offender into custody. He's now charged with carjacking, attempted felony murder, battery on a law enforcement officer, and leaving the scene of a crash involving injury. This just kind of highlights the risk that the brave men and women take each and every day. And just a short time ago, we learned they've added four new charges of leaving the scene of a crash involving property damage. Once that suspect is well enough to leave the hospital, he will be booked into the jail and then appear before a bond court judge. Reporting live in Miami, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News. Leanne, thank